Sorry, police business. that chase. Vinny's been telling me how you're his number one guy now. Don't worry, I ain't jealous. Is he around? He, uh, said something about meeting some private buyer guy? Yeah. To tell you the truth, I'm a little worried. That guy he's meeting, he used to run all the rackets in this city before he got put away. Now he's out? I just hope he ain't trying to cut Vinny out of the equation. You want me to make sure Vinny's okay? Vinny would disown me if he knew I'd sent someone to look after him. Right. So he can't know. All I got was that they were meeting outside in Paradise Sands. Get up somewhere high, and with a bit of luck, you'll be able to see them. Right. Thanks, Mo. No, thank you. <laughs> Sorry, it's an emergency. So this is Frank's parents' hotel. They must be loaded. Right. I need to get onto the rooftop. Ugh, back in five minutes. I don't have five minutes. I guess I'll have to get up the hard way. If you ain't a gym member, you ain't coming in here. I am a gym member. Of course you are. I bet you don't even know how to use that fitness equipment. I guess you must be a gym member, even though I don't recognize you and you haven't provided any ID. My folks' hotel? No, I'm looking for Vinnie Papalardo and Rex Fury. Well, 
I can check the guest book. Th that isn't good. <sighs> Never mind. Have you seen anything suspicious happening from up here? No. Apart from the sinister-looking helicopter that flew overhead a few minutes ago and then landed on the building opposite the Herbert Hotel? The Herbert Hotel? Then that's where I'm going. Hey, what's wrong with my parents' hotel? Is this about that guest who ate the chocolate on his pillow and it turned out it was a cockroach? See you, Chase! The guy who took my car and ruined our party. Oh, brother.
I'm getting really good at using those catapults. Another catapult. Awesome. I need to get to the back of the roof so I can see where that helicopter landed. That's Rex. Vinny is working for him. I'll never get over there. What are they saying? Another job? We had a deal! I got chance to get you all them vehicles. I got you that T-Rex. I got you the Bell Pepper Emerald. And that boat! Do you know how much trouble I had someone else go through for that? Well, I've still got more stuff on my shopping list, Vinny. And you are gonna get it for me. I ain't even been paid for the other stuff yet! I have overheads, you know, and them paintings you gave me ain't any good. What do you mean? They're Bricassos! Really? They look more like faces. Ah, just get the stuff, Vinny, or I'll have to replace you. Rex Fury makes my blood boil! We do all the jobs, we take all the risks, but he treats us like monkeys and gives us... Uh... Peanuts? Chase? What did you hear? Nothing. Except you mentioned Rex Fury. Eh, yeah, what does it matter? Yeah, that's the private buyer I've been working for, and he's just pushed me too far! Nobody gets away with treating the Papalatos like this. We're gonna do a job just for us. What you got in mind? The biggest cheese in Lego City. The Von Stufenberg Cheddar Truckle? Not that kind of cheese. I mean Forrest Blackwell, property magnet, fridge magnet, and king of this city. Forrest Blackwell? I'll tell Mo to take the fire boat and meet you. Get moving. Okay, Vinny. I can't blow my cover yet. Not until I've arrested Rex.
Hey, Chase. I figured this tunnel would look fancier, seeing as Blackwell's so rich. It ain't finished, is it? Blackwell lost interest in building stuff after the scandal. Oh, yeah. What was the deal with that? What? Have you been on holiday for the last few years? <sighs> Not quite. Blackwell was gonna build this massive apartment complex with a mall and everything up in Bluebell National Park. But then someone finds some sort of rare squirrel there, so City Hall stops it. By then, he'd already spent billions building Blackwell Bridge to connect the park to uptown. That must have been embarrassing for him. Oh yeah. He didn't take it kindly. Vowed he'd never build anything again. Right. Now, we gotta be quiet. Keep the engine running. Get up there, get the stuff, and get back down. Okay. It's weirdly quiet around here. Maybe Blackwell security guys are on holiday. Or maybe not.
Okay, Chase. Don't take anything too valuable. Just find something shiny that Vinny will like. If I was a secretive billionaire, where would I hide my vault? Oh, right. Chase, some guys came out of nowhere yeah, and they're after me. That won't I'm attract trying to lead them attention. away from you. Hurry up! Okay, I'll grab the stuff and get out of here. Only one more layer protecting the vault. Uh-oh, company. See? Now that's a sensible place to hide a vault. How does chopsticks go again? Open sesame! Or just open, if you have a nut allergy. Whoa, that looks like a... Who are you? Uh... <laughs> Intruder escaping! Sentinels pursuing! Chase, I'm still trying to shake these guys off. Did you get out? Yeah, but I've got company too. Okay, meet me at the south end of Promenade Gardens in downtown. Right. Keep your wow. eyes on the road, Chase. <laughs> Sorry, it's an emergency. business. Sorry, 
it's an emergency. Mo, are you near Promenade Gardens yet? I wish. These bozos had people waiting for me at the docks, so I ain't gonna be there anytime soon. Get to Vinny's. I tried calling him, but he didn't pick up. Not even just to yell at me. That ain't usual, Chase. I'll make sure he's okay. It's an emergency! What is going on in there? Oh, you guys are making a big mistake. When Rex finds out you did this. Ha ha ha! Who do you think sent us? What? Why did he... I'm sorry. What's that? I can't hear you. Oops. <laughs> I broke the handle. <gasps> I said 
Why did he... I gotta get Vinny out of there. a statue, you idiot. It's as tall as a house. I'm gonna need to break the latch off to get Vinny out. Sheesh, Finny. I know Rex has turned on you, but there's no need to go to pieces. Ooh, thanks! The leader locked himself in the ice cream factory. You can get in through a secret passage in my office. Ooh, I want to know why they did this. What? One of those worms has drawn a mustache on my mother's painting. How could they do that? Do you know how much I had to pay the artist to leave her mustache off in the first place? She'll go crazy if she sees this! Someone get this off of me! Why is it so dark? Is it nap time? If it's nap time, why am I standing up? Wow, Vinny really likes ice cream.
That is a pretty unconventional way of locking a door. How did you get in here? Ah, what does it matter? You can't hurt us! If you're after an ice cream, this place is closed for business. Permanently! I can still see you in that box, you know. Hey, that's cheating! You two, stop him! Don't just stand there! Stop it! Oh, stop messing around down there! All right, now you're beginning to get on my nerves. What are you up to? Okay, no more Mr. Nice Guy. Yeah, that's right. I've been being nice up till now. <laughs> Sorry about the frosty reception, mister. <laughs> Guys, I used. What's he doing? I can't see him. Stop pressing buttons and turning valves. Come on! Can't you guys do anything right? What the? Uh, ow! That hurt. Oh! Hey, get me out of this thing, or Rex or Rex ain't here. Why did he send you guys? I ain't telling you nothing. It's okay, Vinny. I think I know how to make him talk. Eat some more. Uh, oh, yeah, that's mm, so delicious. Ow, ow, ow. Great freeze. Here comes the airplane. Mew. No, stop. All right, I'll tell you anything. Where's Rex? I don't know. Honest, I don't. But I know how you can get to him. I meant to do some kind of job tonight, in the construction yard at Paradise Sands. You could take my place. Y you kind of look like me. Hey, you are the same height. If you're lying... Don't worry, Chase. I'll keep him here. I got a few questions of my own I'd like answered. Yeah, no, no! Whoa! Is that the blueberry and pomegranate ice cream? Oh, that stuff is amazing. Mm. Oh, wow. That is going straight to my hips. Can I get some sprinkles? What? Ellie, 
You can tell the chief I'm getting very close to Rex now. Oh, that's really sweet. Frank? Yeah, I'm looking after the evidence locker for Ellie. So, you like Rex, do you? No, I mean that I'm getting close to arresting him. I found out where his gang's going to be tonight. Where's that? Construction yard near Paradise Sands. I know the foreman there, Albert Spindlerooter. He rebuilt my house after I blew up my house when I tried redecorating my house. Did you know you shouldn't rewire bathtubs? Uh, yeah. Anyway, I'm replacing one of Rex's guys on a job there. Tell Ellie for me? Yes, sir! Are you sure you turned the power off? Yeah. The light went red on the fuse box. Oh, by the way, my doctor told me I was colorblind this morning. <laughs> Are you stupid? Somebody, get him to the chopper. I mean, hospital. Uh, now who's going to cover his shift? Nope. Not me. No uh, way. I've got plans. Nope. No way. How about me? You are plumbing a water main, not saving the world, Damkov. Uh, fine. You need a uniform. You, give him your clothes, your helmet, and your hammer. No, oh, it's okay. I'll find another one. Hey, you'll need to move that barrel. Push it over by that cone and stuff. I gotta figure out who my contact is in this place. Hurry! And get through the door! Don't you have a crowbar? Listen! Fix that fuse box. I don't need any more collateral damage. That you, Jimmy? I got a message from Rex. He wants you to get a crane from this place. Gotta go! Well, that was to the point. I can't wait to have a cup of joe. Don't worry about smashing that crate. It's expendable. My back is hurting from carrying around bricks all day. Have you been lifting from the knees? No, from the construction site. until the next coffee break. gate needs repairing. Did you not hear it jingle all the way? That steamroller was fun, but have you got something a bit bigger I can drive? Like a, ooh, crane? <laughs> Trust you with a crane? <laughs> Thanks. Show me that you're a real construction worker. Fix the hoist controls over there. Thank <laughs> you. 
Found those parts yet? Find the parts. How's the project going? Well, the first floor has gone great, but the second floor, that's another story. The foreman reminds me of somebody. Get those boxes down with the hoist! Isn't anyone else doing any work here? Oh, I'm sorry if this seems like a raw deal. <laughs> you want to drive the crane? Yeah, yeah? Then get through the door up there! Oh, who built that wall there? Idiots! Use explosives to get rid of it! Come on! Come on! Don't you understand a simple command? Oh? No reply? Good! Elevator won't work. Fix the fuse box above it. Glad I remembered my hard hat today. I can still feel where that brick landed on me. Don't you know how to use an elevator? Put the fire out. Wait a second. Why is the building even on fire? Which stupid set the building on fire? How do I tell them that I don't like coffee? I mean, if I tell them I like Earl Grey tea, will they fire me? I think my cousin was fired from the police force for not liking donuts. That or stealing a computer, huh? Shut off the gas valve! Use your strength! <laughs> What's the matter? Oh, come on! There's gotta be a spare around here! Something I can help with? Doubt it. I dropped the key to the gate shed and the guard dog ran off with it. Can't you just take the key back off of it? Oh, yeah, sure. Oh, no, wait. I actually want to keep both my hands.
Getting this crane better lead me straight to Rex. You got the key! You just saved my neck, buddy. Go on! Use it to get into the gatehouse! Oh, there you are. What? How did you... I'm not Albert. I'm Werner, his twin. Oh! Huh! I thought you'd look different. So, you want to drive a crane, eh? Yes. Then you better build it first. No. Oh. Come on, build it. That super build needs a lot of bricks. Think you can drive a crane? Get the crane over to that building! Hurry! the crane to pick up the pipes. Hey, put it in the right train. Now, do the other ones. Are you going somewhere? Don't worry. I'll be back. I hope you don't mind if the crane isn't here when you return, because I'm going to use it to pick up Rex with the very long arm of the law. Huh, that one wasn't too bad. You got the crane, Jimmy. Great. Rex will be real happy. Yeah. Let's go drive this to wherever Rex is. <laughs> You're such a kidder, Jimmy. We're using the crane to get something else. I'll open the gate so you can get it out of here. Great, Jimmy. Uh, sure. Just give me a second. Hey there. Thanks. I gotta drive it up to the observatory. Stay here and see if anyone follows me. I get the feeling someone might try and infiltrate the gang tonight. No. Yeah! Grr. Meet me up there in ten minutes! Sure. Sure. 
<laughs> I am brilliant at disguises. Oh, of all the days to leave my glasses at home! Oh. Ellie, I should know the location of their base soon. That's great, Chase. What's holding you up? My contact in Rex's gang wants me to do something up at the observatory first. But you could give Natalia the good news. If Rex has her dad, their base is where he'll be. Well, I'll try, but I just got her answer machine. I think she's sick of me reminding her to walk my dog. I'll call her myself later then. Rex wants us to steal the telescope out of the observatory. Yeah, Rex does love, um, astrology? Ha! <laughs> it ain't for Rex. It's something for the old man, ain't it? Right. The old man. Well, what are you waiting for? You got a pneumatic drill from that construction place, right? Use that! Do you believe in astrology, then? No, but that's probably because I'm a Pisces. Great! I'll drive the truck around back. I gotta fix the crate. I may have damaged it on the way up here. Keep an eye out for company. And if you see any, deal with them. You been practicing, Jimmy? Anyway, I got this hunk of junk all fixed up. We gotta get the observatory's roof open, cause I doubt that telescope is gonna fit through the front door. Fix up that fuse box real good. It's wired into the dome. do is get the telescope onto the back of that truck and we're out of here man go on get in the crane now stick it on the back of the truck facing backwards that way you can see nice okay now get in the truck yeah okay <laughs> <laughs> 